Hey guys, Chance to play game of Our World is Ended. This is a sci-fi visual novel originally released in 2017, um, but actually this is a Switch version which came out in 2019. And uh, yeah, I remember playing this um, back when it came out. Um, it's a pretty nice visual novel. I mean, there are elements of Steins Gate in this game, and a lot of people say, oh, it's a derivative of Steins Gate. Well, that's a little bit different. It's not exactly like Steins Gate, of course. It's just kind of its own, like, story and, and everything, and I, I really do kind of like it. I don't think it's as good as Steins Gate, but it still doesn't mean it's, it's a bad visual novel. It's still pretty good. It's, it stands on its own merits, I think. Uh, so yeah, uh, I actually, I think Leah would kind of like this one. So, developed by Red Entertainment. So I think they're kind of like a smaller company. But yeah, um, let's start off a new game. I think it's been a while since I played this. So I might not remember everything I was supposed to do in this game, um, but I do remember it was it was kind of like Steins Gate with the time travel stuff. But actually, I think it's not time travel. It's the, um, this game, this world has like a VR type of, uh, yeah, like a VR interface, and it kind of melds with the video game, I think. All right, so it doesn't even, I think the, the, this game is about, oh, what is reality, you know, what is really real. It's kind of like The Matrix, yeah. I think when I first played this game, I think all I was reminded was of uh, The Matrix and Steins Gate kind of blended together. So it's got elements of both. It's got elements of Matrix and it's got elements of Steins Gate. So it's got um, the sci-fi influence is there and it's got this meta reality type of uh, concept in it. So anyways. It's been a while since I've played this game, so I'm gonna... Play it a bit, and then I'll bring back my memories. Yes, this is the Mayuri of this game, I believe. 8 out of 10 normal men would deem her cute. The other two would hail her as super cute. You know Hayase. Yep. Yep, so she's the Mayuri of this game. The super bright, cheerful cute girl that's kind of your best friend type of girl I also love really like this uh, the amount of color in this game now Steins Gate kind of has its own art style which is very uh, distinctive but our world has ended um, you know you can tell this is a very nice art, art style as well it's very colorful that's the first thing you notice about this art style レイジ君。レイジ。いやいやいやいや、ゆうが終わりさんも変態発言は控えてる。レイジ君。随分と異性。あの、ああ。ちなみに<笑> The New World Goggles, alright, that's... I remember this, yes, the New World Goggles is pretty, um, important to this game. Yeah, the AR, AR Goggles. Visual novel, so there has to be a little bit of perverted stuff in it. I'm not tired of looking at this. <laughs> Always gotta be some perverted stuff in these games. This comes with the territory. World program. Uh, that's it. That's kind of like the Matrix, isn't it?
Yep, combines real scenery and virtual data. Voice command. Change the world. 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 Change Put the girls who put on little goggles, of course. This guy is the diary. He is the diary of this game. Oh, picture of those like sequel wheels. This man has a huge perv. Of course he is. There has to be at least one huge perv in these games. And he's of course also the engineer, right? Why is the guy who's the engineer, the brilliant engineer, always end up being the perv? It's kind of like a stereotype for engineers. Otakus, I mean. Uh, engineers have to be otakus and also perfs. Yes. <laughs> Crawl on the ground. Oh my god. That was a guinea pig for his uh, little toy. Of course, it has to be perverted stuff in this game. And it's, yeah, this is AR technology. That's the kind of gimmick of this game. It's not really a gimmick, but it's the main technology of this game, which drives the plot, is this AR device. Remember where your weapons? Oh god. Oh, of course, he has a feed, right? He has like an active feed that sees what I'm looking at. <laughs> You're taking screenshots, are you? You can't. You violate her rights to her likeness. You really violate her own. Oh my god. <laughs> this guy might, might be even more perverted than Daru since Dino's Gate. That's actually saying a lot. <laughs> The memory weapons. Okay. Give me the bikini cat ear combo. Oh no, it glitched up. No, oh, glitched up. What the? Oh yeah, you're transported to a different reality.
Yeah, so this is the alternate reality um, of this world, I guess. With the AR device being the trigger to enter this world. The world's about to start. Overflowed chapter one. Change the world. Because the program, yeah, creates that side effect, transferring you to a different world. I know it's that mysterious girl too. Oh look at that, there's a love motel. It's right across from the love motel. Motel Sting. Game developers really do not have much life. They have a lot of overtime work, especially in Asia. Because, yeah, overtime work is kind of normal in Asia anyways. Yeah, 
Yeah, see how colorful the graphics are and the environment is in this game. That's what I like about one of the things I like about this game. Is that it's uh it's sci-fi, it has a unique concept. I mean it's not totally original, but it's still kind of unique to itself, right? And the graphics. And yeah, you get the same, same cli anime cliches for the characters. That's normal, but this is your, I mean, this guy here. Obviously, your standard cliche otaku guy, who's also a perv. Iruka number two. Yeah. Number See, so all these guys are caricatures. But that's kind of normal for visual novel anyways, but they're, they're kind of stereotypes. <laughs> this guy's so over the top, right? I, I had to give his voice actor props. <laughs> the guy who was the voice actor for this guy, I mean, he's so over the top. <laughs> That's pretty, pretty funny, actually. <laughs> he makes the edge of his sunglasses slash. I don't know, I don't know how he does that. <laughs> His voice actor is so over the top, man. <laughs> oh god. Vocal man, man. Awari oh, son. The founder of Judgment 7, this game studio. The main programmer. Ultra pervert. Oh yeah, he's also a pervert too. Of course. <laughs> oh yeah. Both of these guys are huge pervs. I guess I'm a little bit of a perv too. But both of these guys are huge pervs. Oh god. Reiji goes in. Midnight. <laughs> それから戻ってきたばかりか。ああ。どうしたんだいいえ、その。はあ、違う違う。あっちの方なら、ほら。ウーラーが行っちゃっただろ。ちなみにレイジ君。君に。そうしてまたるだろう。ああ。ああ。
can you choose the UX designer? ほかに該当しそうな人がいないから尋ねるのだけど。はい。一体どうしてそんなことをし。いい人ってそんな大げさ。あなたが私の仲間ですって。あの変態が何を考えているのかは知らないけれど。むしろ邪魔だと思っている
Yeah, this game is a little bit too perverted sometimes. I mean, it's not too much of an issue, but yeah, there's a, there's a lot of perverted dialogue in this game. <笑>どうせ一人カラオケだ。どうせ一人カラオケの何が悪い別に悪くはないさ。ただ、朝の。ただでさえお前は。おまけ、できたわけないです。胸が残念なんだから。変態あんたもなの胸なんてあったところで別
world and heaven. それ。私のことを。いや、あの夏美さんのよ。無理ね。可愛いだけの動物キャラクターなんて。ああ。さすが夏美先生。中高で濃厚でコントとした。バイバイ。ピザにかけるコント。おっほっほっほっ。うわ。おお。お姉さん、いいじゃない。味にも設定にもスパイシーだし。何その上から目線。朝の。そうだけ、ルカス、ボイスライン。え、そうじゃ。え、そうなんだ。わけわかんないこと
、我が輩たちは今まあちょっと独白中現実すごい何を分かっている Okay, yeah, this is、uh, kind of like AR and VR at the same time because this is like. No, this is like totally different now. This is like VR. Yeah, well, I guess it's kind of like a blend. Yeah, so, so it's like AR and VR, I guess. Ish. It's kind of blurred now because it's so different. Oh, yeah, they, it's augmented. On Tony Zoino, a Korekara, they all. Ah, Shokum, sexy, a little monster, 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 a little monster. I decided to use a sexy ultra erotic monster in order for this demo. The model pervert. Oh my god. Oh, then it brings us to the other place, right? どうしてまたプログラムの暴走が起こるおい、何しかおい、くそ。立ち上がることしかないな。わ。それにしてもおかしい。私たちの意見も聞かず。きっとそうね。これに懲りたら。I'm not assuming I should live in the office building. So, yeah, what's up? <laughs> so he's in a kind of a loop now. The intersection. He's he's stuck in a loop. Yes, that's right. He's trapped in this uh, alternate reality now. He's instantly teleported. Okay. He's stuck in a stuck in a loop. Yeah.
Like I said, this game takes a lot of inspiration from The Matrix. Basically, it forces him to be in the office. Be in the office. They're stuck too, I think. どうしたちよ。そんなんじゃないわよ。私たち家に帰って家に帰ると何か問題でもあるの。家賃でも滞納して。そういうんじゃないの。朝の酒を飲むのは結構いやいや正解。酔っ払って道がわからなくて大惨
マジねあだここんなの何かのまもう一度気が済むまでさあありえない何らかのガスによる集団催眠いやさっき久保通りを抜く、えー、っつまり無意識のうちに引き返してたって可能で次にちょっとした成果なーに簡単なことさひょっとしてもうえー、っと逆向きってことは違いますよ優奈さんあ,あとにかくダメなるほど大体はその境界線を超えていやその表現は少し<笑>今よりこの現象をふなふなとなるほどあの尾張さん全然ま世界の言う通りだな、うん、I call the Pac-Man phenomenon because this is what happened Pac-Man as well それで終わりさそんなことをはなんなのそれ<笑>まあ待て慌てるなどうせ浅草からは出られないんだしをどうこうするには基地はここから近いとはいえいはいはいうんスニーではこれよりもういいわどう大丈夫よいいから下ろしてお気に入りの服にあなたの汗が。何をしているの早く冗談じゃありませんも
。浅草。イルカさん、イオロさん。うん。レイジー。こちらは収穫なしだ。今、夜の浅草が再注目されていますじーっとーしょーいやいややめるんだ朝のよこれはだがここまで情報規制が完璧に行なまこうなってしまった以上でででで,でもその時は全力で逃げる一応2人ずつなるほど私もいいと思うわこのままみんなで徹夜よしちょっと待って言っとくけどか弱いか弱いわよはいはいじゃあ男女の部屋を作るとしはいはいこっちが男の子でこっちがあとうだありがとう言うの俺は私よなんだ朝お楽しみって何よお楽しみって私は三番だわ三番は我が輩いるかねま、使えないじゃあ、レイジ君を言うこれで、ペアと順番が来た何かセカイさんおお、来たかじゃあ私も休むエイジ君はいまあせいぜい二人っきりの時間を私は許さないわよもしかしさん大きな声を言うのにしませんってじゃあこういう状況違いますって<笑>今のは言葉のあり言うの何かあったらそれじゃあ二人<笑>正直、それから忘れちゃいけないのが確かに。Forehead to forehead temperature measurement. Can I survive this? Just wait for me.
おおやゆうのから連絡があってねはいイルカはもう少し寝かせておいてやろう夏いってちょっと待てはああれあああの二人はああなるほどねそりゃ確かに起こす世界さんとレイジ君はうんナイスおまいかいそれじゃあまあゆまずは私たちからね<笑>いやとうんあんまり静かだったレイチ我が輩たちも特に異常なしだったさてとこのまま基地に閉じこもってい,いあの怪物といやいやいくら俺でも現象の起こる境界線はそのあたりをなるほどねでも何肩のうんうわがそれじゃあ10分後に基地の前にあの尾張さんよし分かったあれさえ使いこなせればナンチャクス、アメリカ、ブルーフリーで憧れて、ルンチャクの練習ぐらいしたそれはもっともっと上の世代の話ですよ。ズーデコで言わずに、デイジ君のナンチャクス。デイジーよ、考えるのではない。いいから、試して。わかるんだし、ゴッドリー降臨の儀を行う。なさっけないわね、レイジ君。いいえ。ま、無茶なアクションはせず、適当に振り回す。それじゃ
武器は持ってるが昨夜の怪物がある<笑>とりあえず帰っ
Oh my god. <laughs> Taking fairy, oh my god. Second alternate skill. No, this isn't what you think it is. <laughs> Special skill to spell all my is slimy food. <laughs> あれみたいな作って。ね、ストリスティキーズ。すごい。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ち
カレーは辛口型です。はあ、カレーを食べたら体がほてってきちゃったわ。キメロールチェグさん。ちょっと脱がせてもらおう。おお、これは。ちょちょっとあんた、何いきなり脱いでるのよ。もうなぜ怒っているの？あなたの体じゃ。エロリーやめなさい。こんなところで脱ぐ。It's like a walking porno, basically. Walking porn machine. ベロールベロベロス生まれながらに高い悪いを持っていたベロールをしたが生徒に彼女はかつて北の地カルテスオーネルの魔女と思ったそんな魔女を母に持つベロールの字は正規ではそこでベロールちょっと待そういった深い
the chest. Oh my god. Way too much frost in this game. Oh no. Oh no, the good the, the tentacles. <laughs> Oh my god, this brass. This game is so obsessed with brass. This game is like so obsessed with breasts. Oh my god. お疲れ様です。変態は屋上の部屋に帰ったの。ブースリー。ダメね。あの、過去に描いたベロベロスのイラストでも。<笑> 
まるで意味はなかったまさか自分で,で僕だってあんな怪物と戦う羽目になるなんて僕たちベロベロスを倒せるんでしょうかそんなこと私それに泣き言ならしし、ね、時間はかかるかもしれないけれどいつまでもこんな状況が続いていたら新作のゲームが作れなければジャッジメントだいいはいじゃあ私も休むことあのはいなな Right, I guys, I'm gonna stop here. But this is um, the, our world has ended, and uh, this is a, I mean, it's a nice visual novel, I think, for sci fi fans because some people say it's like reminiscent or derivative of、uh, Steins Gate, but I think it's actually its own thing. I mean, as you can tell, it's definitely not about time travel, but it's rather about AR and integrating it with the、uh, reality world, so it's definitely something to do with that. and So it's different, it's its own thing. So I think it's not,、um, yeah, it's, it's not like exactly like Steins Gate or something like Sure, it may take some things from Steins Gate, but it's not exactly like that.、Uh, it has some elements of the Matrix in it as well, and that's what I thought, especially with the AR, other reality type of vibe. So, yeah,、uh, I mean, this is a good game for sci fi visual novel fans to pick up, I think. If you just disregard all this perverted stuff about the breasts and stuff, I mean, that gets a little bit annoying and distracting after a while for me, but、uh, if you just disregard that stuff, I think underneath it is a pretty solid sci fi visual novel. So that's it, guys. Our world has ended.、Uh, pick it up if you like sci fi visual novels, and,、uh, and if you're an otaku fan, <laughs> then、uh, definitely this will be up your alley, or a video game fan. So that's it. Thanks for watching, guys.